Greetings and welcome citizens from the Tubes of You to another brand new series, Project High Rise, where we build a town. It's that simple. Yeah, anyway. Spiritual successor to Tin Tower, I would say. It's an absolutely fine game. I've seen a couple of Let's Plays before. And I've spent about 10 minutes just getting to grips with things so that I don't look like a complete and utter grade A plum the first time I play it. So, let's get started. We'll go in there. And we are going to go with Moltopia Tower. Leave the uh, difficulty at the standard lot size. Standard. Start, blah, 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 blah. Start with a good amount of money. The economy is solid. And tenants are easy to find. Start on a regular sized empty lot. Advanced options. Oh, let's just proceed. Okay, let's start. Oh, that's actually really, really quick. Quite a quick load. You can take additional contracts to earn extra, extra cash. Show me. I uh, remember that one. I'm pausing it because, you know, pause is good. Hello there. I just wanted to remind you about contracts from the city. They're a great way to earn extra cash while helping out our city. You start with one active contract to sign an additional contract by the button at the bottom bar that looks like this. Okay, so at the moment the contract we have signed is... Uh, reach daily rent revenues of $1,000 to be awarded... Uh, a grant, we get 500 on up front, we'll get 500 on completion and a buzz of 10. Now, what do we want? 16 small offices or 50 people? Which one do I think we can get first? Well, that's going to give me 500 up front. They're both going to give me 500 up front. That's going to give me more. So, I'm actually going to go with the people because it looks like it's the easiest one to do, which means I'm more likely to uh, get it first. So, we're going to do that. Uh, we're going to zoom out. Now, one thing that I was doing for my Let's Plays and all that sort of stuff is you've got uh, your utilities. At the moment, you've got, you've got your electric, you've got your phone, you've got your cable, you've got your water, you've got your gas. Now, you've got the main line from the city coming in at this first basement level. What I am going to be trying to do is to try and keep it so all the things that feed my tower stay on this basement level, which means anything that I want to do uh, that isn't above ground and needs to be below ground, I want to do in an additional level below. So in order to do that, well first of all, let's make the whole thing bigger. Let's say that much, and that much, and then we're going to go for an entire one down there, and that seems like a good start. Now, one of the things I want to do is I want to move that set of stairs and I want to put in some elevators. Now, for elevators, having them run next to these conduits sounds like a good idea, and I want to run them all the way up and down because it's going to be quicker. So, we're going to do that. Now, health and safety, fire and all that sort of stuff, we're going to want some stairs. Now, I want to get rid of those stairs, so what we're going to do is put in a stairwell next to our elevators. Seems like a relatively straightforward thing to do, doesn't it? Now, what we need is we need to get the population up and we need to get that up. So, uh, let's see about building a building, which we've got in here. Allocate offices, apartments, restaurants, and then you've got services which they need. Okay, so... Um, in the foyer area, let's go for a restaurant, shall we? Okay. We'll place an empty restaurant there, so people can get themselves a quick snack. You've just allocated empty space for rent. Make sure to click on it and set it to be advertised for rent. Yeah, don't show this again. Okay. So then we'll click on that. And food court restaurants. Central Park Wraps. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oh, well. We'll, do, we'll have a second one, which will allow us to have a look at the uh, thing properly. How, how, how does that sound? So, uh, they need electric, likes high traffic, needs electric, likes high traffic. They're, he's going to pay me slightly more. So, uh, 
Yeah, I got the two. So it serves breakfast and lunch. It serves lunch. Who's the other guy? Breakfast and lunch, yeah. Let's actually let's that. Okay, so we're gonna have those two there. Now we need our workers who are on their way to start filling this out before we can continue. Um, I wonder if I can get rid of that. Yes, I can. I know you can't get rid of it. Um, at least I don't think you can get rid of it uh, if there's no other way to get up and down. So let's go like that and let's run the game at high speed to get them in there. Come on, don't just stand there. You've got work to do. That's it. I think they're doing the uh, lifts. Yes. Now, I need you to fill out the rest of it. Okay, now they're doing the stairs. Looks like day one, primarily, is going to be preparation work. You know what? The music's actually very, very quiet now that I'm actually in the game. It was so let's turn it up a little bit. There we go. Now where, where, where are my guys? Okay, they're preparing, preparing the uh, restaurants. Oh, so we might actually get some tenants before the end of the day. Oh, oh, oh! They need power. See? Okay, lay down electrical line, and we'll do it to that because oh, what the hell? Let's just do it all the way. That way I can fill those in with a couple more f uh, food court people later on. And there we go. Oh, no, that's... All right, that was at high speed. Okay, good. And so we've got a little bit of money that's going to start coming in. And we've got a population of five now. And it looks like they've almost done actually making some of it. Oh, I've got a little bit of space here. A little bit of space. I'd kind of like... Uh, uh, I wonder if you can change priority. Daily budget. Uh, revenue 500, expenses 2800. Yeah, well that's because I bought loads of stuff. Show info every day at midnight, definitely. Yeah, we won't worry about the enhanced reports just yet. But I wanted to go in here. Alright, oh, okay. You can't do anything like that. What happens if I click on him? Um, I can change his name. Eh. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could go, um, actually go over here and deal with this, please. I guess that just means that I'm going to have to be careful in what order I do things. Because it looks like they're doing it roughly beginning to end of how I placed it with the exception of important things like elevators and stairs and awaiting shops. Okay, we can now get some businesses. One. Oh, no, let's delete that. Uh, I want to do it from that side because I might not have enough space to do it all. And Okay, so what we need to do is we need to get a closet to carry the electric up and then we're going to want space although I'm not going to put it in just yet for the plumbing closet there so for now we're going to put in some people we're going to leave that one space two three okay so I need to bring out the entire thing by one fit more in. Okay, so that takes up one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, so we're going to have space for an office on that side when they're done. Um, let's see what we've got. Let's make this all insurance, shall we? Okay, it just needs electric. Okay, they want. They're going to want copy services. Accounting offices are going to want phone lines as well, and they're going to want couriers. So let's just go with the insurance offices because they're just going to want copy. So we have one, two, three, then we're going to give them electric. 
electricity. And then we need to find the services. Where are they? There we go. And let's see. Um, we also need to think about. Uh, all right, yeah, services were here, weren't they? Um, all right, okay. So that's for the businesses. It was copy services. So we want some copy services. Like I said, I want to put them. This type of stuff down an additional floor, so we can keep this floor for all the various banks of phone lines, electric substations, all that sort of stuff. So we'll put some coffee, 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 coffee services would be up here. Coffee services down there. And how big is my area? Because I think there's a thing of construction. Here. Okay, so I can build all along there. Building width 29 times, max 70. Height, two floors, max 60. Floor area 116 tiles, max 4,000 tiles. Uh, low rise. Yep, okay, cool. So let's zoom back in, because it's pointless being too zoomed out at this point. And let's let them get on with things. Oh good, they're gonna concentrate on that first. Get our first business types in. So this floor is insurance, and then we'll do accounting on the next floor. How does that sound? Oh, I've still got the cash, so let's think about doing that like that. Let's get our elevator in, let's get our stairs in, and our electrical substation. They need electric. Oh, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. I did it wrong. Um, I suppose it won't matter if I do one of them out of place. Considering how it works. Okay, let's go. And we're going to be able to get our final guy in there. Your insurance. And then the next insurance guy will go in there. Let's just double check that he's got electricity. He does. Fantastic. And then we're going to let it play on. When does that... Oh, let's place an ad. So we can get another insurance guy in. Okay, so he wants to pay 90.90. Oh, he wants to pay 100. Yeah, you can, you, can, you can move in. Businesses, and you're going to go there, there, there. Uh, total revenues, not a lot. Hopefully my revenue will start being a little bit better soon because I will have the offices in there. Okay, accounting. Well, we're going to want all of them. F electric, phone line, and courier. Phone line and courier. That's what I need. Phone line and courier. So for the phone line, we need to go like that, but it's not set up because I need to put in a switchboard. Uh, so we'll put in a cheap switchboard downstairs. 
there, which hooks it all up. You see, that's what I was talking about, about keeping this floor free for bits. Okay. Um, yep, that looks good. And let's see about running that advert there so we can fill the remaining two. Oh, come on, get a move on. Am I, am I running on super speed? Ooh, I haven't done the wiring. I did it one way, I didn't do it the other. How is my power doing? So, ooh, we're going to need to put another one in. So, connect up. Only 250, it's going to cost 2,000. Yeah, we'll put another small one in. Accounting. Oh, that's right, I've still got to do the courier services, haven't I? Yes. So, services, building, courier. just reached a rating of one prestige. This is a great step towards fame and glory. If you look down at your build menu, some new decorating options are unlocked because of your high prestige. More options will unlock later as you reach even higher levels of prestige. Okay. All right, I see. I can now decorate the walls and stuff. We'll have a look at that later, shall we? I think so. And so we're waiting for that. Okay, so you in there and get you another accountant, uh, the 135 I think. Uh, just double check our services. Yes, we've got the courier down there. That was courier, wasn't it? Yep. And copy. And I think we need another thing in the food court. Uh, oh, we can get a calf now. Right, so these just need electric. Uh, breakfast, lunch, breakfast, lunch. Now the cafes, coffee and lunch. Coffee shop sounds good. Needs water. Okay. And I forgot to put the gap in there for that. Yeah. I've been a plank, ladies and gentlemen. Great A. Oh well. Um... Put it in over here, I think, and then go up stuff. Okay, so right, utilities, water, basic water meter. There. Plumbing closets. if I there we go that fixes that okay cool and I need some money, but I am gonna get one more restaurant over here and 85 we'll go for the other coffee place Oh, 
let's go. It's looking good. It's looking good. It's looking good. Oh, we got some buzz. What's buzz? Buzz is generated by popular retail stores, restaurants, and some offices. Uh, once you reach, you'll be able to spend it on a media campaign. Okay, we'll have a look at that when we've actually a bit closer. Influence is another way of getting boosts. Okay, we can get loans. Prestige. Population. Okay, we're about to find out whether our day was successful or not. Well, in another two hours. Yeah, can't get any faster than that apparently. There we go. Oh, fantastic. You completed the contract. Proof of concept. The reward payment of 500 has been wired to your account. If you fill up to it, more lucrative contracts. Total revenues 500. Okay, cool. So we're now generating at over 500. Um, we need to pause, go into the contracts. Right, so we have half the people we need. For this one, we need to get to 3,000 revenue. For this one, 16 offices. Well, I've got 10. Sign contract. Oh, okay. So we need to get four lawyers and four creatives. So it means we're going to have to build another floor. That's going to be the lawyer's floor. I want, I'm kind of curious as to what they're going to take. Oh yeah, we need our utilities. Our wiring closet. And our plumbing closet. And then we're going to be able to have a small office. Legal offices, four potentials. Uh, we've got career, we've got copy. Okay, what about this big guy? Needs electrical line and a phone line. Okay, so you can, you can move in. Uh, so can you move in. And let's just make sure we've got those houses, shall we? So we'll drag that across like that, and like that. And then we'll do the same things for the phone lines. Drag those across like that, like that. And then we will fill the remaining offices. Uh, 100. I don't really. Uh... Yeah, because they're decent money. So I want to fill that. And then I'm going to have to let it run a while in order to get my cash up, I think. Uh, so yeah, we've got very little, but we now have 15 offices, four restaurants, and a couple of support areas. Ooh, we're going to need more power. What's our power currently at? Demand of 21. So, I can just about afford one more of those. When we've got the cash, we're going to have to see about getting a bigger one. How big is the big one? Okay, so yeah, that's what that little three gap there is going to be. It's going to be more power! There we go. Oh, total revenue is 2,500. That's not bad. That's actually making me think that 
that 3,000 might have been the uh, better one to go for. But yeah, plus 275 a day. Sounds like it could be a good idea. Bill cost free, but it's going to cost me a hundred a day. Okay, uh, done that. We don't want to worry about apartments just yet. That'll be that. That'll be later. Services. See what's right down. Limousine, helicopter, executive club, fitness. Okay. And then you've got services for the people who live here, including wealth advisors. Oh, yoga services. That's funky. I might have to look at the workshop because I know that they've added a load of new business types and all that sort of stuff. Like you can actually have uh, game developers moving into your office. Which was, I guess, kind of the obvious one. Does decorating cost cash? Apparently not. Okay. Do that on the ground floor for now. Okay, can't put them in there. But let's get just making it a little prettier. Hopefully, I'll be able to start working on the creative floor. I've got 50 bars, 7 influence, I only need 3 more influence. Okay, construction. Elevators. How much do elevators cost? 300. Okay, let's get ourselves a bank loan. Uh, how much do we want to get? Uh, well, we did most of that with a starting of 10,000, so let's get 5. 300 daily. Yeah, I think yeah, I think that's doable. So let's get our elevator in, our stairs in, our electric cupboard, our water cupboard, and then we'll start placing our creative offices. Let's wire. Wire. Oh, actually, let's find out what they, they want first. Creative offices. They want electric and a phone, and they need an office supply store. Okay. I can, I, 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 I can help you there. So, let's wire you up. Let's go. And then let's wire up your phones. Let's get you your office supplies, office supply services. Uh, my guess is he's going to need electricity. Uh, yeah, okay, he's hooked up anyway. All the phones are hooked up, so yeah, let's start, start getting these moving in. Creative. 60, creative 170, creative 160, and creative 165. 
how much is that fifth one gonna take for us to run a campaign? Yeah, let's, let's do it. Let's get that fifth one in there. So we'll have 20 offices. Ooh. I need a maintenance office. Building staff, maintenance. There are stairs, people. Okay, so we got our bonus of a thousand. Construct an office for an interior decorator to unlock consultant upgrades on the aesthetics track. Okay, uh, politics, operations. Alright, oh, okay, I see. To unlock the, this stuff. Okay. We'll have a proper look at that, I think, at a later date, you know. Because uh, we're pretty much coming to the end of the episode. So, what I want to do is just get that built and that built so we can have a nice look at our starter office building while it's all lovely and jubbly and stuff there we go there is our office building ladies and gentlemen and if you've enjoyed the episode there's a nice little like button down there to show that you liked it you know it's what it's there for thumbs up and all that sort of stuff if you want to be notified about more episodes of project high rise hit the subscribe button you know i'll appreciate it and we made 8,000 today. 8,000! It's almost 9,000. Yep, meme incoming. And I will see you next episode.